We're moving to Texas! All right guys, Paisley is here and we had a lot of the kids helping. Lily Luke did a great job and Elsie also did a great yeah. job. All right guys, we are driving to my family's Airbnb right now and we're gonna say, we're gonna have a little birthday party for me and then my family's the cutest and they're throwing one for me. Hey guys, um, it's Kennedy, and welcome to my channel, Kennedy K. As you guys know from the title of this video, I just said goodbye to my family. My, if you know my family, I'm the oldest of 16 kids, and I love it, and I think it's like such a privilege to be the oldest of so many kids and um, be their big sister, and I am really excited i'm moving to texas my husband just got accepted to med school there and so i'm taking me and my little family my dog my baby and my husband obviously and we're we're moving pretty far away from where my family lives and we had to say goodbye last night um there's here's a little clip of me saying goodbye to my family i can <laughs> Have the best time in Texas and having your new house. And I'll come back too. So, okay. Because she has a new house. We're going to sit there. I'm so excited. And she said there's lots of shopping. There's lots of shopping so I can make Cassidy come. Oh, I'll dear. still come for the baby ace. <laughs> and you. Awesome. And we love you. you. See you later. Love you so much. I am so, so excited to move and I like can't, can't wait to start this new chapter and to um, just have this new life in Texas. But I'm also really, really sad to leave 
my siblings and I know that I'll come visit but it's just gonna be very different now where I live a lot closer it's easier to come to the small things like someone's birthday or just like little things like a football game or supporting my siblings in all ways and I love doing that as an older sister but I'm not gonna be able to do that when I live really far away and it's kind of it's hard and it's a little sad but I just wanted to be on here and be totally uh, an open book here and just let you guys know that yes I'm excited but I'm also really nervous and I'm really nervous to move to a different state and make new friends and I'm nervous to not have a support system as strong a support system as I do here because the closest support system by us in Texas is kind of farther away and it's just it's gonna be a little tricky and it's gonna be hard and I just wanted to let you guys know that sometimes things aren't like I think it's, it's we just often show the most perfect things in our life on social media but I also wanted to share on here that this is gonna be kind of hard and I'm really nervous and I I cried a lot last night saying goodbye to my family. Again, I'm so excited to move, but I am nervous. Like this is, it's a lot having a new baby and having your husband gone for med school a lot. And like there's, it's a really fun chapter, but I'm also wanted to be upfront with you guys and let you know I'm nervous and I'm scared. I wanted to share a story on here of being scared to get out of your comfort zone. When I was in kindergarten, I started to cheer and I couldn't even do a cartwheel at this time. and. I remember I went to this cheer place and they were well known for having amazing tumbling and I couldn't even do a cartwheel this time and the coach, bless his heart, he was like, you can't even do a cartwheel and he was kind of making fun of me and it made me sad and I started crying and I was like trying to learn how to do a cartwheel and I was really frustrated and I was nervous to get out of my comfort zone and I was scared for just being able to not be able to do a cartwheel. And I remember going into the bathroom and I remember my mom going in there with me and I was just crying and I was like, this is too hard, I can't do it. And I think I just need to quit. And my mom was like, no, you can do this. And she's like, take some big breaths. And so I took three big breaths. She's like, you can be sad for those three breaths, but after those three breaths, you go in that, you out there and you're gonna kick some booty and you're gonna learn how to do a cartwheel. And so I took my three big breaths and then I went out there and I learned how to do a cartwheel and I showed that coach that I could even do better than that and literally two weeks later I was able to do backflips. What I'm saying here is in this experience, I'm nervous right now and yesterday I was crying and, and I feel like we can kind of relate that story in a lot of our lives and any time that we're taking out, we're going out of our comfort zone or we're starting a new chapter and we're scared and we're nervous, let's all take three big breaths and then let's go and kick some booty. And that's what I am gonna do for this move. I, I'm gonna take my three big breaths and I'm going to take this in stride and I'm going to be so, I'm already so excited, but I'm going to make more friends. And that's it, I think that's what I'm scared for is being away from my family and being away from my amazing friends because I have acquired such great friends here and it's gonna be hard to not be able to go to every little thing for my family, but I'm gonna still continue to grow those relationships with my families. I'm gonna make more of an effort to FaceTime all the time and that is where I'm gonna take my three big breaths and I'm gonna be like, all right, we're gonna still be the best big sister and we're gonna try to be there for each one of our siblings and we're still gonna find that support system in Texas. So I just kinda wanted to share that with you and let's all take our three big breaths. I don't know, I my move is not even that like crazy. I feel like I'm very, I'm very blessed and this is not, something that's super serious, which I'm really grateful for. So if you are experiencing something serious, or even if you're experiencing something like trying out for a cheer team and you're nervous about it, or taking a big test, or you're just starting a new life thing, you're going to college, you're going to be a mom, or anything like that, let's all take our three big breaths, and let's go kick some booty, because I need, I need my support system here on YouTube, and I'm here for you guys, and I wanna be in your support system as well, and so, I just kind of wanted to say, let's all be here for each other and let's kick some booty and we're gonna do great in Texas, right guys? We're gonna do so good and we're gonna have such a good life and 
it's okay and we're gonna see our family all the time. Literally my mom's already booked a flight to come visit me. I'm planning to go to Lily's graduation so it's not gonna be that scary. Except sometimes it is scary and I'm just a little nervous but I'm also, uh, it's hard. I don't know why, I don't know if you guys feel like this but I have this side that's like, I am so nervous. I have to make all these new friends. I have to learn all these new things. I have to figure out where I'm going. I don't even know anywhere around that city in directions and I'm gonna have to just figure all life out in Texas. But also, I get to figure out life in Texas and I get to start that new chapter and have a start new, a clean new slate. And that's gonna be fun too, to make new friends. And from what I've heard, medical school friends are like, they're your besties and I'm excited. And I just, I just wanna find my bestie. And I'm so excited for Chase to learn a ton in med school and continue down this path to his career. And I'm so excited for our, our baby and our dog. Our dog is gonna get a backyard and our baby's gonna have his own little nursery and he's gonna make his little friends and he hopefully is gonna wear cow little cute cowboy boots. It's just crazy like how there's so much mixed emotions here and it just, oh, I'm just nervous. And so I just kind of wanted to um, let you guys know that I'm nervous and that it's okay to be nervous and that we're gonna take our big three breaths and we're gonna be able to do this. So, take three big breaths with me. Ready? I'm gonna cry. We can do this. We're gonna do this. We're gonna kick some booty in Texas. It's hard to say goodbye to your family, but again, we're not gonna say, we're not really saying goodbye. So, I'm okay, I'm good. Are you ready, Bear? You ready to do this? You ready to be a Texas puppy? He's ready to be a Texas puppy. All right, guys, I love you. Take your three big breaths, and let's go kick some booty wherever we need to get out of our comfort zone. Aw, thank you, Bear. All right. Love you guys, I'll see you later. Bye.